Hey y'all, welcome to part 7 of my Sekiro Shadows Die Twice Let's Play walkthrough. In this one, I continue to explore the Harada Estate, and let me tell you, do I get my ass handed to. As I said in the previous video, I do make a few cuts so that y'alls don't have to see me do the same thing constantly. Um, but yeah, I do, you know, get my ass handed to quite a bit. So... With that said, I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and remember to game wisely. Alright, let's finish this up. What the hell? Why didn't I do a death blow? Oh shit. Right. All right. How we want to do this again for like the tenth time. Tenth time for me. Probably gonna be only like the third. Third time for you guys. Fuck. Damn sweet, bro. Oh no, man, I'm just trying to get creative, it ain't working. I'm alive again, motherfucker.
Alright, so I'm gonna skip through some of this shit so you guys don't have to see it. I'm just letting you know. You know, some of these enemies are really easy, but then some of them are just not. Oh, come on, let me get up there. Why you gotta be this way? Oh man, I thought I had that bitch. Oh. My God. All right, this is where this is going to come in handy. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah. A lot more useful than I thought it'd be. Ah. There's all sorts of wrong buttons. Come on over. Ah. You bitch, how'd you see me? Oh my... So, I kept dying to that one dude with the giant spear thing, and I went back and learned the Mercuria counter, which should help with thrust attacks. Honestly, we'll see. Because I could have just dropped down, but... Nee. So, try and take out this asshole. No, oh, I didn't get their attention that time. And then I go over here, and I'm hoping that's the archer. Put this guy out. And there we go. They actually went rather smoothly. Good enough for what I want. Okay, and then yeah, I just sneak over here. And I'm gonna jump this asshole. He's got the axe, so he's a heavy hitter. And then he's down too. Fuck. 
How about that? So this is where the axe plus deck is going to come in handy. Takes him out one blow. Practically. Oops, there we go. So then over here, what I do is jump over here, grapple onto that, hide over here in the bushes. So you want to take this asshole out first. Just go in aggressive with this guy. Homeboy over there is too busy c trying to come up here, so we can jump down. Take out the archer. And then we can go... Oh wait, no, he's behind me right now, so... Generally, after you get the archer, sometimes you can hit that guy depending on the location of uh, Mr. Spearboy. And then run down here just to get away from the, all that aggro. I think that'd be rather perfect. Cool. And while he's over here, we can sneak up on him. Get ourselves a freebie. Boom. Fucking heal up, you bastard. Oh my god. There we go. Break that fucker's posture. There we go. Oh my god, finally. <laughs> Prayer bead, hell yeah. About fucking time. The guy was kicking my ass. Oh, perfect. Got this lovely little thing. The reason why I knew all of that from what I was telling you guys is because I have probably had to fucking do this multiple times. Found a strategy that works for me. I'm gonna go over here and get a little XP as well. Because why the hell not? Surprise, bitch. Who are you signaling? Oh man, I got quite a bit of gold too. There's Zen. Which leads me... ...to the next thing I probably missed. Um... Try to think here. Actually, before I go there, I'm gonna show you guys real quick. I missed something earlier. Speaking of missing things. Oh shit, these guys responded. That's right. Well, I can get a sneak kill on this bitch. Oh no. Hey, Bubba. my bitch now. So 
So again, I'm gonna try and do it from this side. Nobody coming to you, son. Okay, so after I talked with this guy for a minute, um, I went over here, but I didn't go all the way around. So, over here at the very end, where I am running around like a buffoon, you will find a bundled Jizu statue. Small Buddha effigy bound in red cloth, raised in prayer between one's palms to restore a note of res resurrective power. To ensway the Jizu statue is to express feelings of parental love. The bundle of cloth is to at least ensure that the little one goes on in peace. So that, well, sounds like gives you another resurrection. Refills it. Okay. So, that's what I wanted to show you. I'm gonna go through here and... Kill these bastards again. Oh, you didn't notice me? Not very good guard, are ya? So I got a lot of coin. I don't want to lose all that. So, leads me to... I'm gonna go to the outskirts gate path. Because I missed a couple things. And... One of those things being a merchant. That's, I believe, right over here. Shit. It looks like I missed something up here, too. Ooh, coin purse. It's actually... Uh-oh. It's actually what I'm looking to buy, too. Because I don't want to lose a bunch of... gold. Nope. Shit! Some bitch. Oh. <laughs> Fuck. You know what? Not worth it yet. Fuck. 
No, I'm not dying. Fuck that. Shooting a fucking cannon at me? Oh no. Oh man, this sucks. How the hell do I get to the crows? Or the merchant person? No, doggo, leave. Hey, rooster. Chicken. I don't care if they're called roosters. I'm calling them fucking chickens. Y'all got a problem? Y'all can fight me about it. Okay, so... How does one get up there? There we go. Care to purchase an offering? An offering? Indeed. I sell items to be offered to the dead, so they might rest in peace. From the looks of you, I'd wager you know a thing or two about death. Go ahead. Buy an offering. Okay. Buy an offering. Ooh. New tool? Fuck it. Cool. Yeah, see, that's what I really wanted. I don't really know if I want to sell anything. I mean... Yeah, it just doesn't seem worth it. Don't use that thing around here. You'll scare the crows. They're very intelligent. Leaps and bounds smarter than other animals. Cruelty won't be tolerated. Okay. You the boss. Go see Homeboy, get that attached. Oh, I also need to get uh that skill that I saw for anything else. Yeah, this. Heals me every time I do a death blow. So Definitely worthwhile.
guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. Be sure to hit that subscribe button below to stay in touch with my content. If you also want to stay in touch with me through other social media means, be sure to check out my Facebook, my Twitter account, and Instagram. All those are linked in the description below and also on my main channel. Thank you again so much, and remember to game wisely. We'll see you in the next video.